Hasbro Studios has greenlit an animated feature film of My Little Pony. The <laughs> script will be written by Ice Age Continental Drift writer Joe Ballerini and is targeting a 2017 release date. Alicia, buy or sell a My Little Pony movie? I buy this. I mean, <laughs> I was a huge My Little Pony fan when I was young and they're still so popular. You've got the TV shows and even uh, my mum was uh, cleaning out my, all my old toys and selling them on eBay and the My Little Pony toys went for so much money. Probably to bronies, but let's not think about that. <laughs> uh, this is going to be produced in-house at Hasbro. I'm glad it's animated. I like the writer from the Ice Age coming in. Maybe it'll have some humour. It'll definitely be for kids, but the producer, writer on the TV series is coming on board too. And along with uh, Gem and the Holograms, it's one of the first pictures coming from the All Spark Pictures production company. Right. So I think it makes marketing sense. They can sell some toys. Kids will love it. Dennis? I, I buy that they're making an animated movie for this. Uh, I sell that it's going to be awkward on opening weekend when all the parents bring their daughters to come see this movie and there's these older gentlemen in there without any children watching it with their brony t-shirts on. <laughs> so weird. Yeah. Now, I got to give some full disclosure here. I, 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 You're a brony? My, my, my opinion might be a little colored. and while I had never even heard of the term brony, but <laughs> my, my wife, Anne, has recently become the senior project manager at Hasbro. Yes. And um, so she's got the inside stuff on a, on a lot of things. And right now I have, I, I'm not kidding, I have some My Little Ponies in my living room. <laughs> um, but anyway, so look, I buy this. And why? Because it does have a following. Not only does it have a nostalgia factor, like a lot of the old 80s cartoon stuff that we're often talking about, whether it's G.I. Joe or mm -hmm. Thundercats or whatever, but it's also got a current following, a fairly successful animated world, and kids love it. I think this will be great for a lot of kids to watch. And I had never even heard of the term brony until <laughs> Anne started working at Hasbro. She was like, have you ever heard of bronies? It's like, what the hell is that? <laughs> and then John Delancey, we just had the guy who played Q in Star Trek The Next Generation was in our office recently. He just narrated a documentary about bronies, apparently. So I'm like, wow. this is a phenomenon, I guess, going around. So while I am not a brony myself, <laughs> uh, I don't get it, but that's fine. I think kids will love it. I think this will be great for them. So for me, it's a buy. Hey, everyone. If you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news, as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.